Hey guys and gals, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jason, this is Old Car Auto Guy. Today we are picking up the remains of Bubbles. So stay tuned. So I'm just on my way to the wrecking yard to meet up with the truck and they can follow us out to the site of where the remains of Bubbles are. Is, are, where Bubbles are where Bubbles is. And once we get there, we'll have a better determination on whether or not he's actually going to be interested in buying the remains uh, of Bubbles from us. Because as a wrecked vehicle, there's a lot less there. The uh, salvage metal weight is down. Uh, I believe he said somewhere around uh, $50 a ton. And of course, a Kia Sportage doesn't weigh a whole lot. And uh, now that it's burnt out, it weighs even last so once we get that figure we'll let you guys know what he's willing to give us as far as salvage value uh, maybe we'll come out with a few extra dollars in our pocket maybe he'll just cover the tow bill uh, from bringing it 10 kilometers from out in the woods so we're almost there we'll catch up with you in just a minute So we've got Mert here from Randy's Towing. He's going to back up to the bank and see how, if we can uh, trip and fall, see if we can get it to drug around and put back up on the truck. Well, Mert says the easy part's done now. We just gotta get her all strapped in here so she's not flailing all over the sides of the edge of the truck. So we drive her down the road. So he's gonna pull her out. And we'll see what we can do to uh, get her strapped together. I got a bunch of ratchet straps for the truck. And uh, we'll see what the game plan is. So like at this point, we've tried strapping things together here, and I think what we're gonna have to do is get a sawzall and cut these sections off on both sides. As you can tell, it's hanging out way too far to be driving down the road, so 
we can't strap them in far enough, we're gonna have to cut them off. So all he's doing right now is we're gonna take it up to the top of the hill here where we can get some better cell reception. He's gonna call in for some reinforcements. So apparently there's nobody available back at the shop to uh, bring out a saw. So in the infamous words of Steve Freeman, we're just gonna send it. Now I'm pretty sure this breaks several rules of some sort. Not really sure which ones yet, but we'll let you know when we get there. And ladies and gentlemen, we have made it back to the wrecking yard in one piece. Well guys, that's going to end this video. It is a different day. Obviously it's raining today. It wasn't when we filmed this video. But we just got off the phone with Randy uh, from Randy's Towing and he is willing to pay me, believe it or not, for the wreckage of bubbles. How much you ask? Well, $50 a ton and it was about a ton left. Of material so I'm gonna run up and grab my 50 bucks and we'll put that rate in the bank and put it towards the project VW so guys I'm still looking for a name for the VW project I hope you guys can help me out with that if you have any interesting names leave them in the comment section down below we'll pick the best ones put them up on a poll on Instagram and you guys can vote for your favorite we'll go with the one that gets the most votes Car Guy and Six Fan Show will be happening this week. I believe it will be on Grant Tommy's channel, depending on how these videos schedule out. If not, it's on my channel. Either way, Thursday evening, 7 o'clock Central, 8 Eastern, and 9 Atlantic, we will be there. One place or the other, we alternate back and forth each week, but we're getting very, very close to taking a little bit of a hiatus over the holidays. So then we'll be back in the new year with some really great stuff to bring to you guys. What do we do in the Car Guy and Six Fan Show? Well, we talk about cars, plain and simple. We talk about our YouTube channels and how we can help you grow your very own YouTube channel. So having said all that, guys, I appreciate you watching. I hope you're enjoying this end of Bubbles content because this likely will be the last video on it. Thank you so much. Guys, stay focused on the windshield, not the rearview mirror. I love you. God bless. Let's do it again real soon.